Woke up this morning, got a blue moon, got a blue moon in your eye. Woke up this morning. For uh, those who don't know, we got this last week. And you know, we had, we had a little fun with it. You know, we were kind of goofing around. But the Dino Mafia is not real. It's made up. It's, 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 it's all just like, it's a map gamer stereotype and it's offensive. The situation was actually resolved really fast, but uh, what was that? People trying to break into my house, but okay. What I what I was saying was the situation was resolved really fast. But yeah, I was I was reading the comments. Uh, those things were so fucking great. I loved them. I loved all y'all's comments. They were funny. Y'all guys kept the meme going. Y'all guys are great. I love you guys. I appreciate y'all for leaving funny comments even in a situation like that. We we kept a funny mood. We kept it going. We're all positive, and I appreciate y'all. Now let's get into the video. Let's get into this week's uh, video. E4 Gaming. Originally, we were gonna do a Maori video. Multiplayer Maori Gaming. Yeah, it was boring as hell. We spent like a good three hours or four hours or so playing as the Maori. All we did was dev up provinces, trying to spawn in dev because uh, they have no content. They were part of the new DLC patch. Uh, they talked about them a lot, but you can't do anything. You just sit there and you uh. You dev up your province to spawn in like the renaissance and shit, and that's it. We started attacking each other because we got so bored. It was it was supposed to be a co-op game. Not doing that again, so uh, we're, I'm playing as the Mohawk instead. Single player. Maori Gaming took all my friends, so here we are. Single player EU4 native gaming. I decided I was going to play as the Mohawk because uh, I was playing as the Chickasaw a couple games ago, and then my game crashed. Wasn't having a good time. I wasn't gonna play as the Chickasaw again because uh, I don't want to repeat what happened last time. Game just crashed. But I wanted to play as a native, so I wasn't gonna play around the Chickasaw, but I wanted to be a native. Yeah, I just kind of decided I was gonna play in the Earthquake Confederacy as the Mohawk. I was gonna live in paradise peacefully. To ensure that this was a, a peaceful place, I built above my force limit a little bit. I only built it up a little bit. Come on, I wasn't harming nobody no how. Haha, <laughs> joke's on you. I actually wasn't peaceful. In fact, it was all a charade. I killed two people. I killed them and I took their tribal territory because I was up to no good. I was a criminal. It's not my fault. It's their fault. They should have known I was a snake, okay? As the Federation leader, sometimes you gotta do these things. You gotta, like, just put people down... Make sure the rest stay in line. I'm sure they all respected me. Like, they are like, oh, he killed those two? I right, chief, I'm staying in line. I'm pretty sure that's what they did. I'm just gonna assume it worked. Uh, I didn't really ask him or anything. That might have come off like a little too rude. Like, I know I killed two people, but I'm not gonna be rude about it. There's like a fine line. It's kind of like on the far end, there's being a dick. And at the very end, like on the other side, opposite end, it's being rude. And you want to stay in the middle. I'm a 21st century philosopher, by the way. Like a philosopher, I, uh, I did a little conquesting. We got some more territory. We need all this hunting territory, all right? We need it. See, actually, I'm really big in this game. It's just you can't see it because it's all hunting grounds right now. Nobody lives there. So that's why it shouldn't matter if I take someone else's hunting territory. Like, no one lives there, bro. You crying over a raccoon. In reality, I was a chief trying to fill up a bar. That's all I was doing. No matter where you play in EU4, you're gonna be waiting for a bar to be filled. That's basically it. It is the cycle of life. That, that's life, I guess. That's life, waiting for a bar to be filled. It is up to man to break the cycle and go to war. So that I did. But after the initial battles, you realize that you can never escape the bar that needs to be filled. So this time it's a circle. They disguised it. This bar has driven me to conquest and murder. And it's alright. Look how big my country is because I serve the mana bar faithfully. And I appreciate it. You see, the best thing about playing a Native American in EU4 is you get tribal development. You get it from building this building here, so you just want to conquer territory and keep spamming this building as much as you can. In due time, you'll see what I've done with it. I, I kinda I kinda did a little funny haha. -ha. To get to that point, I had to kill more people. You gotta believe me when I say it's part of the method, alright? I needed a lot of land for what I was gonna do, so I, I conquered everyone. I, I didn't make really any friends at all. And sometimes, that's okay. I'm not coping right now, alright? Sigma grind. Mindset. You don't need friends, okay? I'm alone in the woods like Shrek because I choose to be. I'm just a little lonely. Poor little me. I murdered everyone who could be considered my friend because I wanted tribal development. I think I am the bad guy. If only I had a talking tree I could talk to right now, like in that Disney movie. They'd tell me I made the right choice. 
Through my trials, I was able to eventually form the Iroquois Confederacy. And I was rewarded with more broken land. Yeah, there's a bug for Native Americans where they just get broken land. Like, they never patched this yet. Like, why? Like, why does this happen? This happens every time I play as a Native American. Why? I guess a colonist could fix it, but I was- I would rather use my Diplo points, you know, spamming development. And the main way I was gonna spam development was to take out a loan. A lot of loans. Yeah, for some reason, they let a tribe out in the middle of nowhere start taking money from the international bank. I mean, hey, 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 come on, come on. You know, I was good for it, all right? And they knew I was good for it. With this money, I, I spammed as much tribal development buildings as I could. We needed to get this development up. We just started generating people left and right. Like, holy crap, this is so easy, bro. You just generate an entire nation. It really is this simple. If you want a population, you just gotta buy it. Like, don't get me twisted or anything. I'm having a good time right now. I'm not really complaining at all. Instead, I'm playing SimCity. This is what we need. We need SimCity making with map games that would be the perfect game well i guess that's kind of what imperator rome kind of is uh, i don't know I, I gotta play that game a little more I don't, I don't know anything about it really i just kind of own imperator rome i did a little more conquesting here just a little bit i needed to save admin points so just a small amount of conquesting i needed to catch up and tech fast so i came up with a very uh very genius plan a very smart plan what i did was uh i left my computer I went AFK. Yeah, I just started working out and like doing chores and stuff and then I'd come by and I'd uh, click the technology button on the screen and then I'd uh, just go back to doing what I was doing. I got a decent workout, like nothing like major, like it was just small stuff I had in my room. But you know, it, it, you know, it worked out, it worked out. I feel accomplished, I guess. We caught up in tech almost, like it was good, everything was going good. But my good times would come to an end, for you see the Spanish they were uh, colonizing the south of America. They owned Mexico and the deep south, and ooh, yeah, they were there. They had negative relations with me. I was trying to uh, repair that for a while, to no avail. They decked on me, like, why? What, what do you gain from this? I don't even have resources. I got uh, tobacco. Like, I get it. I'm number two on the great power slot, so I guess they wanted to beat me up. I wish they would leave me alone, because I would have left them alone. But alas, we cannot do that. We had a war where they sent most of their troops over and then someone decked on them in Europe and I guess they pieced out with me. Like, what did they expect was gonna happen? Now that the war's done, I can sit and look at my giant city forever. And that's what I did. I, I just looked at my giant city and I was like, damn, I built that. And then I got bored. Like, I was like, you know, I kind of did what I wanted to do. I didn't want to conquer anyone. I just wanted to dev up a lot and be like, damn, I dev'd up. That, that's all I wanted to do. Now I guess I'm gonna go and get me something to eat. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna go do. Just picked up my food from McDonald's, love that place, and uh, we're riding our bicycle at night because I'm trying to uh, get some insurance claims, okay? In theory, if my plan works out, then this McDonald's just paid for itself. Now we just gotta drive into ongoing traffic. Why'd the music stop? I'm not going till the music turns back on. Fuck. Alright. Yeah, okay. I Look, alright, I, I got tense, alright? It's a lot harder to drive into a car than it looks, okay? Like, you, you get tense, you stop up. I'm, I'm not a coward, it's just like... It's genetics or something, like, my body won't let me drive in. That guy just got... That guy did my whole plan. I thought my plan was original. No, that guy got hit by a car. He probably got a settlement. Fucking goddamn. Wait a second, is that him? Yo. How'd you do that? How'd you get hit by a car? Can you teach me? Fucking prick. Oh. Well, I'm back at McDonald's. I'm gonna do it. I didn't do it. Fuck. You see, that's what I'm afraid of right there. Like, what if I lose an arm getting hit? <laughs> Yo? Ma'am? Hello? Yo, shoes untied. And we're back. What is this? Groundhog's Day? Uh, I can't read that. Is that, is that Hebrew? And so I said, uh... A, f a few brews for a couple Jews, eh? Shit.
My hamburger okay though. Yo, sir? Listening to that death metal? Alright, I mean, if he gets into it, he's into it. Yo, that man a whole sloppy Joe. Oh, and there's footprints? Okay, well, I guess we gotta follow him. A train? I guess we gotta wait. See, I'm gonna sing to this ghost. I'm gonna get out of this shit. So, I'm gonna, like, serenade it. I'm gonna be like, uh... Put your head on my shoulders. And then, and then, um... Baby! We'll hit him with that. We'll get him. It's gonna work. Like, she's not here now, right? Okay. Okay, I, like, I thought I embarrassed myself. I thought I revealed the whole plan. Oh, fuck. Uh... You like Nickelback? I... Nickelback, uh, I know a Nickelback song. It goes like, uh... Go and make it as a bomb, man. Go and get it as a poor man. Dude, you don't like Nickelback? You don't like Nickelback? No Nickelback? Oh, shit. I go don't like Nickelback. I got, I gotta get out of here. Oh, shit. In reality, it's my bad. We, we don't live in 2006 anymore. I guess Nickelback, not a, not a big name anymore. I take it, she is not a fan. Ow, my toenail. Uh, is that Greek? I don't. What are you trying to tell me? I can't understand you. Motherfucker, put ketchup on my cheeseburger. Sorry, I was distracted by my cheeseburger. You gotta forgive me. Yo? Looks like someone's about to get that insurance claim after all. You know, I am the luckiest man in the world. Like, legit, I can't stop winning. Alright, alright, you're gonna need to speed up and you need to hit me, alright? 